Hey guys, hope it's going well for you. I just want to talk about the coronavirus. It's crazy. It's out of control. People are out of work. People are locked up in their homes, and and we feel like we're in jail right now. We think we need. Uh, I think we need to. I think we we need <laughs> we need Jesus in our life <laughs> so we can go out there and and live a wonderful life, you know. And people are just like getting scared, so they're using they're using fear to scare people out and. They're using fear to make money right now, so they're scaring the heck out of people. And it's a, and end of the day, it's still a business to the government, the president, and it's corrupt. There, people got to pay uh, pay bills, people got to get food, they need to pay stuff, and it's just out of control. People have are out of work, they can't do anything. The stock market is out, and there's a way to make money. And during this, how to make money with coronavirus, people are out out of jobs right now. Um, people don't have health insurance. I feel sorry for people who don't have health insurance. Um, people don't have uh, like a, a stable income. It's 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 about investing in yourself. You got to invest in yourself, and by investing in your health, because your greatest asset is your health. Well, I mean, you can't do anything in life without health. You know, I mean, jobs. You have to have the full time job in order to have health benefits. But you still can't rely on the health benefits, even like uh, insurance, health insurance, life insurance. When you die, dude, it's, it's a great industry. It's like they're just profiting up money from you, just banking up from people. Like it just sucks, man. The the the, the, the world we're living today's day, government don't want you to live long. They, they're making money more sick care industry. People are just making money, getting people sick. The you know, doctor prescribing prescription drugs to people and stuff like that, and why would you want to get into prescription drugs and they're not there to help you? They're causing more symptoms. Like they're not there to help people to live a better life. And if there was a cure to cancer and everything, all these diseases, there'd be people wouldn't have to go to the doctors, wouldn't have to go to 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 get uh to get help. And there wouldn't be in business. Pharmaceutical wouldn't be in business. Doctor wouldn't be in business. Uh, the drug industry won't be in business. And the whole world would be upside down apart. And if everyone's rich. No, everybody be doing it, and if it was easy. Everybody be doing it, but life is just tough, and you just gotta go out there and just go educate people, invest in yourself and your health, and that's when you take care of yourself, and you can go out there and educate people about health. That's what I do. I love to educate people, and people say, "Oh, hey, isn't that it's a hey, hey, it's a scam, man." Hey, be careful with that thing, man. I was like, "Dude, it's not a scam, dude. If it was a scam, you won't get nothing out of it. You just..." Giving out money and then you're never seeing that money again. You're getting exchanging money for product or service, and that's what I love to do. It's like invest, and you don't have to do the shipping. You don't have to do the shipping. You don't have to do on a like inventory overheads, paying employees. You just we work together, build this thing up, build a relationship. We're our mouth business, and then the company will send out the products to the customer, to the end user. You're just a middleman, and you get paid, and that's like e-commerce, like. Come on, man. That's like everything. On, everything is on digital and online right now. You just gotta learn how to brand yourself and put yourself out there and and going out there. I just can't stand these narcissistic psychopaths in California. Every time I go to Whole Foods, I try to talk to some people and I try talking to them. I was like, "Hey, man. Hey, how's it going?" I was like, "Hey, you guys. You take supplements, by the way? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do. I take like 10, 20 supplements. Um, and then I was like, "Yeah, yeah." And the old man was like, "Yeah, I, I." Um, I asked him, like, do you have an email, sir, by the way? Oh, no, no, sir, I don't have an email, but my daughter do. I was like, oh, dude, what the hell, man? I don't, dude, I'm just asking for an email, not your daughter's email. I'm like, dude, are really? But you can't fix it, but get the hell out of my way. I don't need you, man. I'm like, dude, so many people think they know everything about health, but they don't know anything. So, hope this uh, help video uh, helps you anyways. I'm still going out there. I haven't got sick. People are fighting for food out there, and people are making medical claims. And next thing you make medical claims, they're going to throw you in jail, literally. So, um, and it's going to be crazy. It's a good time to go out there and educate people about health. And don't let fear and stay positive and don't let the negativity get to you. And stay awesome, smile, and give people compliments. And let's go change the world one at a time. Stay tuned for the next video. It's from Michael Lewis' office. Smile.